What up and welcome to Rama Screen YouTube channel and here's my review of Prime Video's new series, Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Let's rock this. Alrighty, this one's gonna be a doozy. So we're all big fans of that 2005 movie, right? Brad Pitt, Angelina Jolie, playing a married couple who each of them did not know that their spouse was a spy until they found out and then they had to kill each other. Or at least try to. <laughs> One of the most exciting action thrillers of the previous decade. And so this show is a reimagining of that. But it doesn't follow the concept faithfully down to the T. For example, Mr. and Mrs. Smith on this show already know that they're both spies from the beginning. So they're not, oh my god, you're a spy too? I'm a spy too. What a coincidence. <laughs> but the problem is, I would not use the word exciting to describe this show. Now, don't get me wrong. There's a lot about it that I actually enjoy. But there's a lot more about it that frankly disappoint me. And it all comes down to this. If you're looking to watch a drama that psychoanalyzes relationships and marital problems, then you've come to the right place because Mr. and Mrs. Smith leans heavier on that aspect. But if you're looking to watch some espionage action, boy, don't get your hopes up, because Mr. and Mrs. Smith drags out slower than a senior citizen's electric scooter. It's so, so, so goddamn slow! Created by Francesca Sloan and Donald Glover and showrun by Francesca Sloan and based on the 2005 film of the same title, in this version, two lonely strangers land jobs working for a mysterious spy agency that offers them a glorious life of espionage, wealth, world travel, and a dream brownstone in Manhattan. The catch? New identities in an arranged marriage as Mr. and Mrs. John and Jane Smith. Now Hitch, John and Jane navigate a high-risk mission every week while also facing a new relationship milestone. Their complex cover story becomes even more complicated when they catch real feelings for each other. What's riskier, espionage or marriage? Starring Donald Glover as John Smith and Maya Erskine as Jane Smith. Okay, I like the pairing or the team-up of Donald Glover and Maya Erskine two of my favorite actors of our generation. Word has it that Phoebe Waller-Bridge was initially set to play Jane Smith, but ultimately walked out of this project after creative differences with Donald. I'm not sure what that fuzz was about, but I'm glad Maya stepped in because she's actually quite solid as Jane. And the chemistry between Donald and Maya seem effortless. You see, each of these actors had previously written and created other shows for themselves that were successful, shows that were rather comedic in their nature. And so while Mr. and Mrs. Smith is not a full-blown rom-com, but Donald and Maya deliver this show's very subtle, very adult-centric sense of humor to perfection without breaking a sweat. And they bounce off of one another really well. And the casting of Maya in particular allows her to bring some of her own qualities into the character Jane, like her heritage, for instance. And they throw that element in there, and that adds to that regular folk, next-door neighbor vibe, which is their cover, you see. The other thing that stands out is the selection of guest stars on each episode, from Alexander Skarsgård all the way to Parker Posey. They all play these quirky, memorable supporting characters whose presence in Mr. and Mrs. Smith's lives, for however brief it may be, compels John and Jane to examine their relationship again and again and again. Speaking of which, some of the relationship psychoanalysis on this show is a hit and miss. Some of them can apply to any field, not just espionage, like matters of personal insecurity, when your spouse makes more money than you do. I mean, stuff like that can happen in any household, which can lead to suspicions. But other parts are way too on the nose. 
It's as if the writers had just finished watching a self-help TikTok video and then constructed a long-winded narrative around it. Yeah, we get it. Relationships are hard. Marriage takes work. And it's not all sunshine and rainbow. And yeah, when you decide to live together without knowing the other person well enough, you're gonna start yelling at each other. Gee, aren't you a genius? Tell us something we don't already know, huh? And it takes them forever to get that point across. This show badly wants to serve as a commentary for couples everywhere. So much so that the action, unfortunately, becomes nothing more than an afterthought. So yeah, above all, the pacing is very problematic that there's a chance the show will fail to hook you early on and you will tune out by episode 2, which I don't blame you because immediately you'll come to the realization that the firecracker mostly happened in the trailers or in the previews. So yeah, overall I give Mr. and Mrs. Smith the rating of 2.5 out of 5. The final episode is my favorite episode for all the obvious reasons, but good luck sitting through everything that comes before that, because this show is more boring than thrilling. So that's it, that's my review of Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Smash that like button, hit that notification bell, share this video with everyone you know, share your thoughts in the comment section below, and as always, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Let's rock this. Mm -hmm.